Welcome to the Canada Science and Technology Museum in Ottawa, Ontario in our Mega Science Exhibition. Hi, my name is Michel, I'm an educator here at the museum and I'd like to talk to you about telescopes. The beginning of modern astronomy is often linked to Galileo building his first telescope in 1609, roughly 400 years ago. While he was not the first person to use telescopes, Galileo made several important discoveries, notably craters and mountains on the moon, spots on the sun, and other moons circling planet Jupiter. Ultimately, his observations revealed that the Earth orbits the sun, which was revolutionary in a time when people firmly believed the theory that the sun, the moon, and the stars all orbited around the Earth. Let's take a look at this telescope. The Zenith telescope was built by the Trotton and Sims Company in London, England, and dates from about 1872. Surveyors used the Zenith telescope to mark the boundary between Canada and the United States along the 49th parallel in western Canada. The surveyors weren't interested in studying the stars themselves. Astronomy has very practical uses for surveyors and navigators. The positions of stars in the sky and the distance between each star can be precisely measured. Surveyors and navigators can use the stars to measure distances anywhere in the world. Measuring the position of stars, surveyors used this telescope to determine the location of the 49th parallel. Interestingly, the main purposes of the first national observatories from the Royal Observatory in England to Canada's Dominion Observatory in Ottawa was to be a starting point for surveyors when drawing maps, but also to provide accurate universal time to navigators and railway companies. To learn more about telescopes, visit the Canada Science and Technology Museum.